Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. One question I sometimes get from Lightroom users is how to share images between the different versions of Lightroom. You probably already know that Adobe has several different versions of Lightroom. For example, right now we're looking at Lightroom Classic. This is the original version of Lightroom that was here from the beginning. Lightroom Classic keeps all of your images stored locally. What I mean by that is your images are kept either on your computer's internal hard drive or on an external hard drive that is plugged into your computer. A few years ago, Adobe decided to come out with a cloud-based version of Lightroom where all of your images will be stored in the cloud. They call that version of Lightroom simply Lightroom. Now going hand in hand with this cloud version of Lightroom are three different mobile versions of Lightroom. They have Lightroom for iPhone, Lightroom for iPad, and they have an Android version of Lightroom that I've never used because I do not own an Android device. Now going hand in hand with those three mobile versions of Lightroom and Lightroom is a web-based version of Lightroom. If you go on your web browser to lightroom.adobe.com and log in, you'll have access to all of the images that you have on the internet or in the cloud, and you'll be able to edit them from within your web browser. Just go to lightroom.adobe.com, find an image you want to edit, click on it, and then on the right hand side you'll have many of the controls that are found in Lightroom so that you could actually edit your image through your web browser. Your edits are shared to all of these web or cloud-based versions of Lightroom. So you don't have to worry about sharing images between Lightroom Mobile, Lightroom on the web, and Lightroom. All your edits will be shared between all those applications automatically. The problem though is with Lightroom Classic where your images are kept locally. How do you share images from Lightroom Classic to the cloud-based versions of Lightroom and or how do you share images from the cloud-based versions of Lightroom to Lightroom Classic? Well, I'm going to show you how. Now you'll notice I have Lightroom Classic and over here on the left-hand side we have collections. You'll notice that there's one collection that I've called Offsides off-sized prints. It has seven images in it. And you'll notice on the left, it has this weird little arrow thing. That weird little arrow thing means that that collection is synced with Lightroom in the cloud. What that means then is if I go to any of those mobile apps or the web-based app, or in this case, Lightroom, and I look at albums, you'll notice that off-size prints is here. It's an album. Albums in the mobile version of Lightroom, Lightroom and the web-based version of Lightroom are the same exact thing as collections in Lightroom Classic. Why they didn't use the same name, I don't know, but they're the exact same thing. So we have those seven images here in, in um, Lightroom, and they're over here in Lightroom Classic. So I sync them. So to sync images from Lightroom Classic to all those cloud-based versions of Lightroom, what you need to do is create a collection, put the images in Lightroom Classic that you want synced in that collection. For example, I have this collection called Working Collection. I only have two images in it. But if I want to sync these images with all those cloud-based um, versions of Lightroom, what I need to do is just go over to the far left. You can see there's a little box over there. When I hover over it, it becomes that weird double arrow. Just click on it and you'll see Sync Working Collection with Lightroom. Now we'll go over to Lightroom and eventually that collection will become an album in Lightroom with those two images in it. If you want to see the status of the sync when you're in Lightroom Classic in the top right hand corner, this this cloud, click on it and you'll see that syncing to photos, it says. 
over in the regular version or just Lightroom, I should say, there's the cloud there as well. And you can click there and you can see there it says synced and backed up. It isn't quite ready yet because we haven't fully uploaded those two images yet. So once those images upload completely, they'll be synced with Lightroom as well as the mobile versions of Lightroom, as well as the web version of Lightroom as well. And any edits you do in any of those apps will get traded back and forth. And those edits will show up with um, Lightroom Classic as well, as long as you keep the image in that synced collection over here. So as long as you keep the image in that synced collection, it will... Um, get the edits that you do in Lightroom or the mobile version of Lightroom or the web version of Lightroom as well. Let's see how we're doing. Of course, it's taking a long time. Now it says sync. So we'll go over here and working collection. We'll click on it. There's our two images now over here in Lightroom. We'll go over to the web version of Lightroom. You're going to have to reload the web page. So we'll reload the web page and then you'll see working collection is there and our two images are there. Now, if I do edit here again, or I do an edit here, or I go to my iPhone and do an edit there, or I go to my iPad and do an edit there, all those edits will be shared between all these apps, including Lightroom Classic, as long as I keep that image in the, this synced collection. That's all there is to it. Now, how do you do it the other way? How do you share images from any of those cloud-based apps to Lightroom Classic? Well, you need to start in Lightroom Classic. First, create a collection in Lightroom Classic. So I'm going to create a collection and I'm going to call it my uh, shared images, shared photos, all right? That's what we'll call it. And it's going to be empty, so I'm not going to put anything in it, right? So we have my shared photos. I need to sync this collection with the cloud. Again, I need to go to the left and find that little box and click on it. So it's syncing that collection with the cloud. Now, again, in Lightroom, they don't call them collections. They call them albums. So eventually over here, we'll see, and there it is. My shared photos is here. Also, if I go over to the web version and I reboot the web page again, you'll see it over here. And if I happen to have my iPhone hooked up so I could record the screen or my iPad, you'd see it there as well. Now, you guessed it, to share images, what you need to do now from any of those cloud-based versions of Lightroom, just put images into that shared album. So my shared photos. So let's just, um, oh, let's just find some images. Not those, I don't want to share. Here's some images I took on my iPhone of flowers here. Let's just share four of them, all right? So I'm going to click on that one, that one, that one and that one. So we're going to share those four. I'm just going to drag them into my shared photos. So they're in this album now. Now, eventually you could click on this cloud. It's going to start syncing. It does take a second to start. And once it, there it is, it's now syncing those items and it's synced. They're up to the cloud. Now, eventually they'll be in my shared photos here and there they are. So that's how you sync images between those cloud-based versions of Lightroom. That includes Lightroom, Lightroom for iPhone, Lightroom for iPad, Lightroom for Android, and Lightroom for the web uh, with Lightroom Classic back and forth between those apps. Thank you, everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. Talk to you guys soon.